Okay, viewers, coming back uh, to the live shots of Prime Minister Narendra Modi holding that uh, road show in Palakkad. Jai Lakshmi uh, continues to be live with us. Uh, Jai Lakshmi, you know, visuals, of course, we have seen in state after state, Prime Minister Narendra Modi holding uh, a road show atop an open jeep in his signature style, waving at his supporters, flanked by supporters from both sides who are showering petals on Prime Minister Modi. But help us understand really the importance of the visual we are seeing and why this particular seat of Palakkad is so very crucial for the Bharatiya Janata party. behind you and why not so there are a lot of excited of course BGP cadre who have uh, lined up there to meet the Prime Minister to catch a glimpse of the Prime Minister but uh, viewers as we were telling you the Prime Minister of course uh, is uh, there in Palakkar BGP is of course trying to expand its footprints in Kerala and it is this constituency which offers a very good chance for the BGP to open its account and that's why the BGP has its eyes there BGP has been very steadily increasing its electoral base at least a vote base in the district of Palakkar and they are hoping that this will be the district which will provide it a foothold, a gateway into the state of uh, Kerala. At the moment, the Prime Minister has arrived there. He is holding a road show there. It's obviously in his uh, signature style. He's, uh, there you can see him waving at uh, a sea of supporters there. Uh, BGP cadres, of course, uh, supporters who have gathered to welcome the Prime Minister. Uh, a flower shower, petal shower on the Prime Minister from both sides. Very, very similar scenes as we see the Prime Minister. Madhav Das on the phone line with us. Yes, Madhav, take us through these visuals. The Prime Minister, of course, uh, you know, holding a road show in Palakkar in his signature style, flanked by supporters from both sides, but also help us understand the significance uh, of uh, the Palakkar district, why it's so very important for the BJP. Well, uh, Palakkad, you know, in the last assembly election, uh, the candidate uh, from the side of the BJP, uh, it was one of the high-profile contests, and it was Metro Man Sridharan who had been the candidate uh, in Palakkad as far as that particular election is concerned. And therefore, the BJP hopes that amongst the seats where its prospects are brightest, including Tiruvannantapuram, uh, including Patanam Titta, where Anil Anthony is the candidate, and Trishur, Palakkad is one of the uh, five seats where the BJP hopes to be able to make a mark. And that's why it's significant. The Prime Minister holding a roadshow is a significant on ground. And the overall push of the Prime Minister this time around that we have been seeing, particularly focusing on the southern states and particularly in the deep south, Tamil Nadu and Kerala, where the BJP has traditionally not done very well. The Prime Minister's renewed focus over uh, uh, 20 uh, such uh, visits to the various southern states and the maximum number of events that the Prime Minister has participated in, whether they be rallies or roadshows, are in the states of Tamil Nadu and Kerala. So very clearly, the BJP hopes that the Prime Minister's extensive campaign on ground will help it to push its numbers uh, the charge of our target that has repeatedly been cited by the BJP will, of course, be possible or will fructify only if it does well in the five southern states as well. Of course, in Karnataka, the BJP has traditionally been very strong. It has won in the last three uh, parliamentary elections. Uh, handsomely over the Congress in that particular state. But in states such as Andhra Pradesh, Tamil Nadu and Kerala, the BJP will be hoping to open its account. Last time round, it had uh, not won any seats in those particular states. But with alliances, for instance, in Andhra Pradesh with uh, 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 TDP and the Janasena, uh, in Tamil Nadu as well, tying up with various parties, and of course in uh, uh, Kerala as well, the BJP of course going it alone, mm -hmm. uh, hoping that it will be able to make a mark in this entire election. Well, absolutely, and we'll have to wait and watch uh, whether the BJP will be able to convert all the support which we are seeing on our screens into actual uh, votes and uh, a seat as far as Palakkad is concerned. Thank you, Mother, for joining us with all these details. We step into a short commercial break. News and updates on the other side. Don't go anywhere.